What's up guys, Maxim here, welcome back to another video, I hope you guys are doing fantastic, and uh, it's about time we address, uh, like, um, something that you guys have been wondering for a while, and, uh, which is like, did I quit... Uh, Seven Deadly Sins Grand Cross, and uh, if you guys like new to the channel and you're not familiar, I used to play Seven Deadly Sins Grand Cross like 24/7, sort of. Um, I made content. We made like more than 250 videos, uh, like on the channel when it comes to Seven Deadly Sins uh, Grand Cross, and uh, it's been really, really fun. Um, I made like PvP content, PVE content, um, like I made everything, and most of my subscribers uh, that came at the at the start that came from uh, Seven Deadly Sins Grand Cross, uh, yeah, but uh, most of you are wondering did i quit uh seven deadly sins grand cross and uh, the question or uh to answer your question is that i actually did yes i i stopped playing this game for um for a while now uh, like i feel like I feel like I, I grew uh, some sort of like a uh, distance from it the moment that they they took the uh, tower trials which is like was my favorite uh, sort of activity in the game and uh, the lack of PVE content uh, I kind of like grew uh, like apart from this game and especially like after what is it called uh, like the double collab which is like was V zero and also uh, what are they called the uh, Stranger Things collab like I kind of went nuts and spent it like an insane amount of uh, money just like to uh, get both um, but I wasn't able like to get their cosmetics because it's it was like kind of added up uh, like after a while so um, yeah is this game just like kind of died out because uh, basically what they wanted to do it's just like release an incredible amount of like characters and uh, at some point you just like don't know what you're gonna do with those characters we have like almost 160 characters and uh, you get you never get to uh, to try them in PvE content unfortunately uh, don't get me wrong when you just like f or first start playing the game it's no problem at all uh, because you're gonna have like so much content to go through and so many objectives to to, uh, to do but once you reach like late game you're pretty much done for because you have like every character almost maxed out and um, you just like can't choose which character to level up as well which is like makes it so much easy to go through uh, like everything uh, but uh, yeah when it comes to PvE content the game is lacking so much so um yeah i kind of just like grew apart and especially like when it comes to like the final bosses as well you can just like grind them or grind the hell out of them just to like to get really really disappointed at the end um because there is a lot of hackers i don't know if they actually fixed the thing with the hackers but look at this guy like thirty thousand. like there's a lot of hackers that even if you want to like to grind the pve content you can't because um at the end you're gonna have like s six or seven hackers just like taking the top ranks and uh, you're just like pretty much done so it's just like gonna gonna i don't know it's just gonna make you so much disappointed and not worth grinding at all so you just like want to get the rewards as fast as possible and just like dip and um it's just like repetitive content to be honest with you um like over and over again you're just like going to be doing the tower or trials or the tower of disaster that they release all the time thankfully they just like release a new tower trials uh, but uh, yeah this was like my my favorite content to do in the game like sort of but after they removed it for the other tower trials uh, which like releases sort of uh, one floor uh, after i don't know like how, how much how many times like once a month or something and we used to like to get like 25 floors a like a month which was like much much better but now we just like have to wait a month to get one floor extra but when you first start playing the game i think if you accumulate them over time it could be better in the long term but uh, if you're a late game kind of player uh, you're pretty much done for but uh yeah when it comes to pvp as well uh like i reached the things that i wanted to reach and plus like uh the one Askinor made the game so unbalanced uh when you have him like six six and like super maxed out uh you can just like rush his ultimate and one shot like every single uh player pretty much oh we got okay we got we got some gems maybe we can summon on the um on the banner that we have right now uh but yeah it's like pvp i reached like top 100 on both sides uh, i kind of like felt like i made every objective 
in the game uh, but the reward was so much like disappointing uh, i feel like and that's why i sort of like i grew a part of this game like the game was really really awesome for me and especially for the channel uh, i love the game and so on but i, I feel like the devs did a uh, wrong uh, by not releasing like pve content i'm sure like a lot of like the bigger uh, content creators when it comes to grand cross are uh, sort of like the um, complaining from uh, like on, on the same subject as well the lack of pve content sort of i mean like the bosses in this game are such a joke when you reach la late game and plus like if you have like certain characters such as like um i would say like sario or something like maxed out uh, you're probably like gonna cruise through the pve content uh, like pretty easily which just like makes you kind of grow apart uh, from the game itself but yeah the animations and everything i still love the game i love the anime and um it's just like i, I kind of was hoping ragnarok will bring me back but at this point i feel like ragnarok is not going to bring me back i'm s and unfortunately i'm just like speaking with you guys uh, so just like don't get disappointed but um, it is what it is and if you want to stick, stick around and uh, just like um to the like throughout the journey it would be really really appreciated of course i would really really appreciate it if you guys like stick around but if you want to uh just like unsubscribe and just because uh, you were a subscriber because of seven deadly since grand cross i do understand that uh but um it is what it is hopefully it gets better but uh let's summon for these ones uh i had like someone take care of my account uh for me and he'd been like summoning and doing all the good stuff uh, i just like felt like i don't know it felt like it was it was a waste uh just like to have um, a maxed out account just like sitting around uh and not doing anything so i gave it to someone that can farm bosses uh with it oh my god okay okay the only summons and we got shafted <laughs> Uh, I mean, like, don't get me wrong, like, Bound looks... Oh, we need three gems. Let's farm three gems. Uh, yeah, it's like... Uh, don't get me wrong, like, Bound looks, like, very, very fun uh, to use and so on, but uh, well, what are you going to use it for? Like, the story is on, on pause, and um, the PvE content is on pause as well. But, uh, yeah, Ragnarok seems like it's not going to bring anything good as well uh, from the look of it, uh, since we saw, it's like saw it pretty much on the um, Japanese side and so on. So, yeah, I'm really, really disappointed. Oh, I don't know. How can we get three gems? I forgot. Maybe the dailies? Do they give? Do they still give? Uh, um, oh, wow. You get three gems from that? Okay. Oh, you don't get too much gems. Okay, you get three gems from that so that's four so you get five so it's still it's still pretty much the same it's pretty much the same uh i would say like i don't know yeah i'm too lazy to farm anything <laughs> and i don't want to spend any money in this game so we're just like gonna leave it at that all right yeah that was me answering a question because i get this uh, question like sort of like frequently on almost um uh, like every video i uh, just like you guys are wondering if i left um uh, uh seven deadly since grand cross and um yeah i kind of grew grew a part of it like to be honest um it's just like like i said uh the lack of pve content and just like how many banners that they release like every every month or so on especially like after the re-zero plus like the stranger things as i mentioned earlier it kind of like made me grow apart uh, from the game itself but yeah if you still play it like props to you because yeah um hopefully it gets better for you all right thank you so much for watching and your understanding as well like i mentioned if you want to stick around throughout the journey i would really really appreciate it because we have so much things uh in store for the channel and i'm thinking about so many things that we can actually do together and if you decide to like to uh, unsubscribe i do understand as well uh, because you wanted to like to see more seven that since grand cross content i don't know why i didn't make this video anytime sooner but uh yeah it is what it is and uh, thank you so much for watching and uh, i'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.